All right, guys, today we're going to do a carburetor and fuel lines on a Home Light 26 CS. Um, this customer's already taken off his air filter, so uh, you don't have to do that part. Um, I'll put the kit in the description below. Comes with everything you need uh, fuel lines, filters, fuel filter, spare fuel filter, primer balls spare plugs, um, carburetor adjustment tool for adjusting the carburetor and the carburetor. So everything you need, super cheap, we we'll put it in the description below. Um, this is actually a very easy job, it's not a big deal. Um, it's Torque 25's um, screws, these are the little star head deals, those are called Torque 25's. Take those two out and you just pull these out just that easy <laughs> all right now we're gonna go ahead and just pop this off just off there all right gonna remove the fuel lines bottle cable it's just a s cable just twist off all right that's out of there um we're gonna get the uh get old gas out of this drain this tank out remove the fuel lines out of the tank Clean the top of the tank off, cut the fuel line into a point, start in the right hand hole, shove it down in about an inch, then we're going to bring it up, you know, just up here, like around this area, cut it off, so we got plenty of space for the, uh, for the carb to hook up and extra line, cut this into a point again, shove it into the left hand hole. And we're going to get that in far enough to where we can grab it with needle nose and pull it out of the gas cap. Just like that. Cut the tip off. And then brand new filter. Put that on. Like that. Turn around. Shove it in. We want to make sure that the filter is sitting on the bottom of the tank like that. We're going to leave this one long. We know that that is the line with the filter on it. Brand new carburetor. We need to get a gasket. Oh, did it come with a gasket? Yes, it did. So, this carburetor you notice has a little hole above the big hole. This gasket has a little hole that's going to have to line up with that. That is going to be. Where is that going to be? That is going to be up. So we're going to put our air filter assembly through the carburetor. Then we're going to put the gasket on so that the hole lines up, the two holes line up. That little hole is a vacuum line that runs the fuel pump that's built into your carburetor. So it's important to have that hooked up. We're going to hook our throttle cable up. Tighten this back down. Okay, so the bottom nipple is the one that goes through the long line that has the filter. So we're going to cut this to length and put it on. Like that. Top line is return line. Cut it to length. And it goes to the right hole without the filter like that a little fresh gas in it brand new bought today gas and we'll use brand new gas prime it now if you see foamy bubbles coming out of the filter it means you put it on backwards if it primes up it means you put it on right gas cap back on all right, so it needs a little bit of a carburetor adjustment. It didn't want to idle. I'll do a whole nother video on that. That'll be my next video. Um, and of course, you know, got the carburetor tool for that. Um, normally you would put the air filter on after this and the cover on, but this guy doesn't have air filter cover. So that's what he gets. All right, guys, this helped you out in any way, shape or form. Give me a thumbs up, hit that subscribe button. I'll put the parts in the description below. Just click the link. Um, yeah.
If you want to do any advertising on my channel, message me. I'll be more than happy to have you. Peace.